Hello Cancer and Cross Watchers. Thank you so much for tuning in. This is the your love reading. If you like the reading, please be sure to click the like button. And if you just tap on the red subscribe button, um, you will see any future readings that I post on your feed. Now again, if this does not resonate with you, um, it is a general reading. It is not meant to resonate with everyone. It is only meant to resonate with whoever is looking for um, a specific message. Please be sure to check your Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. You may find the answer to your question there. Okay, so we do have Earth here, a lot of Earth, uh, Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus energy, a lot of Earth. I mean, I would say that we are definitely dealing with an Earth sign here. We have water energy here, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. We have um, an air sign here, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. We have fire, which is uh, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries energy, um, but a lot of earth. I mean, we have pentacle, 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 a lot of earth across the board. So I have a very strong feeling we're dealing with an earth sign, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo energy. Okay, Cancer, so ooh, we have the world. The world is the energy of this reading, Cancer. Something is going to come to a completion. Um, you know, a, a part of your life has come to full cycle, and now it's ending. Okay, we have new success happening. The, the old patterns, the old, the out with the old, in with the new, you know, it's all coming to a completion. Uh, that might be karmic energy coming to a completion. Um, you've paid your dues in life, and now, you know, you're going to have successful new beginnings, all right? Now, here we have the Six of Pentacles, again, as I stated, an earth sign. Um, so this indicates money coming in. It also indicates balance, okay? You're trying to balance your, your career, finances, and, and love, okay? It could also indicate uh, balance, or it could be that someone's going to help you, you know, financially, or you might help someone else. And also in love, you may be giving um, a little bit more in love than you're receiving. So you're trying to find some type of balance, Cancer. And... <clears throat> excuse me, to clarify uh, the Six of Pentacles, we have the Strength card, okay, which means that, you know, you're, you're trying to find strength to balance everything out in love, work, career, finance, um, you're trying not to uh, handle things the way you did before, okay, you're not trying, you're not, you're not trying to um, respond to situations the way you did before, you're growing as a person, you're, you're growing, um, in every way, finances, love, you're growing, you're learning how to handle situations in life with more grace and maturity, all right? Um, and this leads you to, to understand that in order for you to have a peaceful mind frame, you have to balance, all right? So here we have the King of Pentacles, okay? So this can be an Aries, Aries Taurus energy. Um, now, this Aries Taurus energy, he reminds me of like a very controlling and selfish person. This is someone where it's his way or the highway. Um, he just sits back looking very smug. Everybody's running around doing, you know, his kingdom is running exactly the way he wants it to run. And um, this is someone from your past, I believe, okay? Because here we have judgment um, and new beginnings, okay? And second chances, okay? So this may be someone from your past coming back for a second chance here. All right. So you're in the middle of trying to balance out your life and, and grow as a person. And here comes, you know, Mr. Pentacles trying to look for a second chance. Yeah, you see, you have someone coming towards you here. Someone coming towards you very slowly. I mean, this is like he's at a complete standstill pretty much. I mean, he's scared. This guy is worried about what's you know going to happen. He's coming to you slowly, offering you an apology there. You see that? Um, and to clarify that, you have wish fulfillment, okay? So that might mean that this person is, um, you know, they're really changed. They're, they're changed from this behavior, you know? Um, they may miss, you know, feeling like that. You make them feel like a king. That can also represent that also. You make them feel um, like a king. But, you know, they're going to come back with this apology and you're going to get your wish fulfillment. You're going to get your wish fulfillment with this person. Um, here we have the Ten of Pentacles, 
okay? The Ten of Pentacles means uh, an inherit a windfall of money, an inheritance through a third party person. So, I mean, I see money coming in, I see the knight offering you money, you know, this person, um, you guys may have separated, they may be doing very well for themselves financially, and now they want to come back and apologize for what they did to you in the past, okay? Um, and you're obviously not going to respond in that, you know, hurtful way that you did before because your life is changing. You're, you're a different person now. Um, and I feel like, I mean, this is financial success, love success. You see the family there at the bottom with children and happiness and a house, just their hands to the sky, just blessings raining down. Um, you know, so if you take them back, it might involve, but this person, it seems like they're going to be bringing money with them. But here you are, Cancer. I feel like this is your energy. The Queen of Swords. You still have your sword up, Cancer. Um, you know, she's a very strategic person, very, you know, she doesn't like think with emotions, you know what I'm saying? She, You're using your brain here. You're like, okay, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. You hurt me a lot in the past, and I don't know if I should trust you, and you have your, you have your guard up, Cancer. You do not know if you, if you, you know, but he's coming to offer you everything. He or she, you're, this person, this ex, is coming back to offer you the world, Cancer. And I mean the world. I literally, ha, look, the world. <laughs> they're, they're coming to offer you the world. They want to give it all to you, you know? They really do. They want that, they want that second chance, Cancer. And you're just sitting there like, it's so funny. Look at your hand, how it's up with the sword up. Like, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Stay your horse. Stop. Stop talking to me for a minute here. I need to think. You know, you're you're very guarded. Okay. So here we have the six of pentacles that's being clarified by the eight of wands. Eight of wands is communication. A lot of communication, Cancer. Okay. So you're trying to balance everything out here. And you have someone that is really trying to get your attention. I mean, really trying to get your attention. Okay. Um, we have here, oh, how sweet, your king of pentacles is your soulmate. Your king of pentacles sees you as a soulmate. Um, he feels like he was your soulmate, that, that you guys were soulmates. And that's why he's coming back to offer you the world, Cancer, okay? So he's sitting there, this is what he's looking at. He, he wants the happiness, the happy, and look, everyone's celebrating there. Everyone is celebrating here. He wants that back. He wants the way you made him feel. Cancer, he wants that back. And 1111, the two pillars, there's 1111, that's soulmate. So he may feel like you, he or she may feel like, I'm saying he because it's a king, but we know that that doesn't apply. It could be a he, or she. Um, that could be you, it could be your partner. So somebody, somebody here is missing an ex, okay? Somebody here is, is missing somebody. And the reason why I say an ex is because we have the past and second chances here, okay? So I don't feel, and I, I don't see an ace anywhere here. Okay, so it, I don't think it's something new beginning. This is definitely something from the past. Somebody is coming back with a massive apology, and I mean that big of an apology, okay? They're going to bring with them, you know, financial stability, and uh, you or your person, but I kind of feel this is you, Cancer, are going to be like, yeah, you need to just, like, hold on a second, okay? The, you're, you're still very blown away. I mean, this is, it's going to come out of nowhere, you know what I'm saying? I mean, look at all these messages shooting to you. So it's going to come out of nowhere, and that's what's going to, I think, make it even worse, because you're going to be like, whoa, you know? So here we have the Hierophant, okay? The Hierophant is um, clarifying the Knight of Pentacles. So this may be, you know, the Hierophant is a uh, marriage, okay? So this might be an ex-husband or an ex that you were very, I mean, engaged to, that the commitment was very deep, living together, okay? So the commitment was very deep. So this may be someone from your past that's, you know, um, coming in and uh, they want to come in slowly. They're scared to come in slowly, but I don't think they're going to be able to control themselves because we have a lot of messaging coming here, you know? So um, I think they have a little bit of fear of coming in, but they're coming, okay? So... And this, this is someone that you were very either married to or in a very deep commitment with, okay? Now, we have the Ten of Pentacles being clarified by the moon, okay? So, you know, they have the financial stability, okay? They have that now. 
Um, they want to come towards you, but I think, again, they're scared. What did I just say? They're scared. They're scared of the unknown. They're scared of you're going to reject them. I think the fact that they maybe have gained a little bit financially, they're doing better financially, that's the only thing that they have going for them, that they can, you know, offer all of this, because they know that after what they did to you in the past, you have every reason to be sitting there with your sword off up you know what i'm saying they know i mean if their apology is this big cancer they really hurt you in the past all right so they know i mean that i guess i i think they might feel here what i'm getting from this is that they don't know what's going to happen but they feel like money can solve the situation they feel like the fact that they're they're more financially stable that that will prove to you like look i've changed i've become more responsible okay now I don't know how I don't know how well that's going to go over because again here all in the same column here we have you know not knowing I'm going to bring money to the table she still has her you know guard up and then we have the knight of pentacles like I'm just going to stand here and keep offering her money <laughs> you know what I'm saying so I feel like that your person this ex coming in um, is financially well off he he did well for himself during your separation and I feel like. Um, he's going to use that financial stability to try to get you back instead of using love, Cancer, okay? But the messages are coming in, all right? And he really is willing to offer you, he or she, I'm sorry, I keep saying he because I'm looking at this this king here, but of course it could be he or she, your, your person, um, it is really going to come in and offer you the world, all right? So here we have the strength card being... Uh, clarified by the Knight of Swords, which is taking action. You're taking action to... To, to, you know, to have strength in this situation, to change your life right now, um, okay? I mean, really, uh, what I feel here with these two first cards is that you're just minding your business. You're just trying to fix your life, become a better person, focus on your own life, and all of this just kind of hits you out of left field. I, I feel like you're like, well, la -di -da. like, let me, I'm just sitting here doing my own thing, trying to better myself as a person, and all of this stuff kind of hits you out of left field, Cancer, all right? So, you know, we have, th this is taking action. You're taking action in life um, you know, to try to better your life, and this is all just kind of coming out of nowhere. Now, this person is, again, charging in, okay? So we have Mr. Second, the past, Mr. Second Chances, Mr. Past here, charging in. I told you it was going to be fast, the chariot. The chariot is fast movement, fast messages. He's just going to swoop in out of nowhere and be like, hey, listen, I'm coming to pick you up, we're going to buy a house, <laughs> okay? That's, that's the type of... You know, you, you may not have spoken to this person in forever, and they're just going to call you and be like, yeah, like, come on, let's go, we're going to buy a house. Okay, you're coming with me. You know, I mean, just something as simple as that, and you're just going to be sitting there. Look at your hand up like, I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know what, what, what is happening here, but you're just guarded, and you're definitely, like, refused there. So, now the wish fulfillment card is clarified by the sun, which is growth and recovery, okay? So growth and recovery definitely is... Uh, positive for Mr. Um, you know, past and second chances. That's definitely a, a good card for him. So that means that he might win this battle. All right. Um, he definitely might win. Because I see here that, you know, the Knight of Pentacles is, uh, you know, this is you and him right now. This is you and your ex. Your ex is coming towards you you know, offering you an apology, and you're just sitting there with your guard up, you know, I don't know, you know, I don't know if you're going to take it or not, but I do see growth and recovery there, so that could, the growth and recovery could go either way, though, I mean, it is clarifying the fulfillment card, so I'm assuming that, you know, there might be recovery for the relationship and reconciliation, but I feel like the growth and recovery card, I mean, if you decide to not be with this person, because your guard is up there, Cancer, okay, so you have to use your intuition there and figure out, um, because I'm seeing money, I'm seeing he's offering you the world. Um, oh no, I do see love here. I do see, you know, I don't know if he sees you as a soulmate or if this is an actual soulmate connection because I don't see that many cups. I only, well, we have the we have the 10 card here, but I mean, really it's more about money. All I see is coin everywhere. Coin, 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 coin. It's, it's really all about money. So, I mean, I, I don't know, you know, if this person is really bringing you a cup of love, you know, he's bringing you a lot of money, a lot of wish fulfillment, I mean, you're going to be able to buy whatever you want, but I'm just not seeing, you know, I'm not, I'm not seeing too much like a Mr. Poet coming in, okay, but then again, let's keep in mind, we do have the King of Pentacles coming your way, okay, he may think he's above, like, he just wants to show off and, you know, show you how much money, you know, he's like a, 
like being a peacock a little bit, okay? So let's see here. Let, let's see. Let's ask the romance angels. Let's see what messages they have with love, okay? What messages do we have for cancer? So let me jump right out. I can't tell which one came out there. So. So, Cancer, we have the underlining energy here is Honeymoon, which is kind of funny because this is the same card. Uh, enjoy the bliss and holiday time of being together. So, this is also represented as the Honeymoon card in the Minor Arcana. And here we have Honeymoon here. Okay, so there may be reconciliation, all right? It's, it's possible. So, here we have Soulmate. Yes, this is your Soulmate, okay? So, again, this is a Soulmate card. Now, keep in mind, though, that doesn't mean that you should always be with somebody because a Soulmate... You know, soulmate connection doesn't always mean you're going to end up together, but it does mean that, you know, you guys had a very strong bond. Again, marriage, the, the bond was strong, all right? Worth waiting for. Divine timing is at its work in your love right now, okay? So, you know, your guard may be up, okay? But it may be worth taking a step back and understanding that maybe the separation needed to happen for you to grow, for him to grow, okay? Because again, look, his finances are way in order. I mean, he obviously got his life together and you are getting your life together, okay? So obviously you guys separated and both of you are working on, you know, whatever needed to be worked on. And, um, you know, maybe it was worth waiting for all this time for it to come back because here we have attraction. You're attra you attract romantic love by enjoying the moment fully all right so if he does come back no when he does come back because this is just obvious someone's coming back um you know don't be like this cancer don't put your guard up completely okay so i mean if you attract love that love will come to you so he's coming to you with money and i think he's coming to you with money on top of the board here because he is scared of the rejection okay because look at you cancer i mean you're like the queen of ice here okay so maybe be a little bit more loving and it will attract the love coming out from from this person okay because you're i have a feeling you're going to want to see love this person's all going to be money 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 you're going to want to hear about love all right so this is a lot of communication coming in and all i see is coin okay but you want you know you want love so in order to attract that person to talk about love you're gonna have to become love yourself you can't act like this because then they're just gonna sit back and be scared and not offer you their heart but offer you other things so that their heart doesn't get broken cancer all right um i hope you enjoyed the reading and again, please be sure to like and subscribe if you did. Um, you can subscribe by just hitting the red subscribe button so that any future videos that I post will just come up on your feed. Have a wonderful day, Cancer, and take care.